veterans who are coming back from the war, many of them feel that the psychological wounds that they are coming home with have not been successfully treated by the currently available uh, treatments that are offered to them through the VA. That They work for many soldiers, but there are some people for whom the currently available treatments do not work. And I think there's a lot of discontent by veterans who are searching for something else. And MDMA-assisted psychotherapy is something that can be helpful when other treatments have failed. And what we're trying to do is work with the Veterans Administration, with the Department of Defense, so that they can integrate this as one of the tools among many that they work with vets. And I think if they were to do so, they would have a higher level of um, satisfaction and cures among the vets that they're working with. Th this study is of crucial importance to us for our negotiations and discussions with the VA and with the Department of Defense. Because if we can show in this small pilot study that veterans who have not been able to be helped by the currently available treatments and medicines can be assisted to lead healthier lives through MDMA therapy, that we'll be able to talk more persuasively to the VA and to the Department of Defense how that this might be one of the tools that they want to add to the treatments that they offer through the formal system to the veterans that are coming back.